in today's session let's see how to create a legal entity uh, before going to this creation of legal entity uh, let me just navigate the options which are there in this 360 file from here we can go to any legal entity that we created and to create a legal entity we have to go to this modules and we have to go to this organization administration okay after going to this organization administration we have to go to this organization and under the organization we have to go to this legal entities and from here you can see the list of legal entities here uh, to create a new legal entity just we have to click on this new and let's name our legal entity uh, and let's uh, let's assume that this mahendra company is in usa so i'm taking it as usa so mahendra and the company suffix is mm and the country is in usa so let's click ok and you can see our and legal entity has been created so our legal entity name is Mahendra and the company symbol is MM and we can write any memo here and in the next topic let's see what is this hierarchy and how to switch it on and this is user you this option is used for consolidation process so we can switch it on in case we have uh, multiple legal entities in the same uh, application and if we don't want this particular company uh, not to be in the consolidation you can just eliminate it by switching on this option and this localization function this we can give it as any country so let's think that this is an United States okay localization functionality you can just give none or uh, if your country is listed here you can just look uh, the country is listed here so i'll give if it is not listed you can use this option none and the language is english united states and you can select your time zone i'll just select the pacific time and from here you can just click on edit in this address thing and you can update all the addresses for now i'm just not updating this you can update it and after that you can give the contact number and in this contact number there are a few options that are enabled in this like linkedin twitter and facebook these social networking links has been added recently in this 365 so if you have any statutory reporting you can just update here and these are all not mandatory it's up to you and uh, registration numbers bank uh, account information foreign trade logistics and if you can see this number sequence so for now there is no number sequence uh, we get this number sequence once we run this number sequence and additional registrations dashboard images if you want to update any dashboard images we can update here to update it we have to go to this uh, banner or logo just click on logo or banner and uh, just click on this change browse to your uh, image and just select and it will be changed for now i'm not changing it i'm putting it as a default and later on you can change your company logo also and print design default you can select anything 
these are the tags information and that's it for now and uh, in the next session let's see about this hierarchy and why it is used thank you